Hey guys, welcome to the channel. This is Karen Merrill. In today's video, we're going to be talking about how to monetize your YouTube videos in 2018, how to get in front of Hungry Buyers Part 2. And this is if this is your first time to the channel, welcome. This channel is all about affiliate marketing, how to make money online, how to make money from home, and how to have freedom and choices to do what you love. And if those are topics of interest to you, go ahead and click the subscribe button and the bell icon. That way you'll be notified when I upload new videos, which right now is on a daily basis. And if you're returning to the channel, thank you. I appreciate you. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the content. I'm going to just briefly review what I talked about in the last video, how to monetize your YouTube videos in 2018. Position yourself in front of hungry buyers part one and we talked about how important it is to be on YouTube because of the monthly users being so high in the billions and how we I think that YouTube will take over TV of what people are are actually spending their time on and we talked about how to position yourself in front of people that are looking for what you have to offer because they're already searching it and you're just putting yourself in front of those people uh, finding a very specific niche and we talked about how to create valuable content and places to look to get ideas which is YouTube search Google search um, type in top blogs for your niche and see what topics they're covering and model around those topics go to Pinterest because they have a search engine and search topics there and see come up with ideas there use uh, videos that you've already done that have good views and in today's video we're going to be discussing how to position your video for SEO how to find keywords how to write your title your description your thumbnail and the frequency of of your videos so sorry let's get this up here so in your, in your title, you want your main keyword at the beginning and then create an open loop, which is curiosity. So in the last video, we used um, the keyword CBD oil effects. We found that that was a good keyword. And you can see here the search volume is 3,100 a month. So you want something over 1,000 searches a month. And this plugin that I have here is called Keywords Everywhere. You can just go to Google, type in Keywords Everywhere Chrome, it'll be the first one. And that's free to download. And then I'll tell you what people are searching for because you don't want to use keywords that no one's searching for. And you, so in your title, you want to put your main keyword at the beginning. So you're going to have CBD oil effects. And then after that, you're going to create a catchy title, something that people will click on because they're, again, you created this open loop, like they have to know what you're going to talk about. It's like, this is good. The truth about CBD oil or don't, don't buy until you see this. So you can look at um, the titles of some other videos and just kind of model around that and come up with your own unique spin on it and something that um, would create curiosity and, and have people click on it. And then we're going to talk about the description. You want to use your main keyword at least two or three times in your, in your description. And then what you want to do, like I did here, is you want to use the link the watch link to the actual video after you publish it in your description to create a, a backlink so what I did here in this in my description you kind of describe what you're talking about um, what you would the action you want your viewers to take you put here at the very top because this is going to be shown above the fold the part where before they have to click on show more you want that to be above it so they don't have to scroll down and they're just going to summarize what you talked about in the video and here's where you can put your watch link you can say please be sure to share this video with your friends and followers and then, then go ahead and put the watch link in there to get a backlink and help with your SEO 
and then you can add links to your social media accounts. Like at the bottom here, I have um, my Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and you can also include other videos that may be of interest just to keep your viewers more engaged. That um, YouTube rewards that and helps that helps your video rank the longer somebody watches your video and stays on your channel. And then in the bottom part of your description, you want to include the titles of the top five videos at the bottom of your description. So you would type in your main keyword to YouTube and then you would go ahead and take these top five titles and paste them to the bottom of your of your description and what that's going to do is when somebody clicks on this one here that's got 580,000 views then you can be shown in the right hand side in the related related uh, videos so that will give you a chance to rank or to be seen and then as far as putting your your tags in the very first keyword you want to use in your tags is your main keyword so it would be your CBD oil effects and so that's going to be down here in your tags and another way okay so here's how you're going to find your tags is you're going to go to YouTube and you're going to type in your main keyword and you're going to go to and you're going to search vidIQ 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 and that's just a free plugin on Google Chrome and if you can see we're gonna click on this this first one here that's got over 500,000 views and YouTube used to show you what the keywords are that that the person's using in their video but they don't anymore but this plugin allows you to kind of spy on the competition and see what they're using and you can use the same keywords so, okay, we're just going to scroll down here, and right here, it's telling you all the keywords that this person is using in their video. Sorry, Mike, this is running really slow here. Let's, here we go. So you can look and, and use some of these keywords here. Hemp oil benefits is a good one. Um, CBD benefits, so you can see they're ranking number nine for that. See what keywords they're ranking for and use some of these keywords. And then also go to um, go to Google and type in CBD oil effects. And then um, you can look on the right hand side here, scroll all the way down and you can see the related searches that people are looking for when they when they put in that keyword so I would say side effects CBD oil side effects but look at this number two buy CBD oil that's a very profitable keyword because if they're searching buy CBD oil they're looking for the best one so that would be a great way to find uh, related keywords to put in and help you rank. And then after you put your tags in, you want to create a thumbnail. And you can do that by going to canva.com. And this is a free site. You're going to use your main keyword in your thumbnail and then create something of curiosity to get people to click on your video. 
so you can see what some of the video uh, some of the thumbnails that I have done here you just go to create a design and they have one that's for YouTube a YouTube thumbnail you can scroll down and you can see right here YouTube thumbnail and then you just choose one of them and you can upload your your pictures and I don't know why this is running so slow but what I wanted to show you I'm not going to go through exactly how to do it right now but what I wanted to show you is that when you when you save this thumbnail at the very top you're going to be able to rename it okay let me see if this is caught up with me now all right so you're going to, here's your uploads you can drag over your images you can create whatever you want in here but what I wanted to show you is right here up there at the top you're going to put in your your main keywords you're going to do CBD oil and then you're going to you're going to save it with CBD oil effects with your main keyword so that's going to give you more SEO power okay and then after you publish it you are going to share it on all the social media sites you don't have to create accounts at the in these um, on these sites but as soon as you publish it then you want to you want to share it so let me just show you let me go back to my channel here So these are going to create backlinks to help with your SEO and a lot of my videos are ranking on the first page of YouTube and that is going to just get more traffic and over time what would as far as the frequency of your videos that you post, you want to do that on a daily basis because over time it's going to give you more traffic, more views, and you'll eventually be able to take part in the partners program, which requires you to have a thousand subscribers and four thousand watch hours per 20, or 12 months, and then you can start making money with Google AdSense. But I was going to show you here. Um, as far as sharing on the social media sites, once you publish it, at the bottom, where it says share, it will have all the social media sites. I'm just going to click off this because it's taking too long to load for some reason. Um, it's going to have Reddit. LinkedIn, all those sites, so you just click on it and just share your video, so that's going to give you backlinks to your video. So that's how you monetize your YouTube video and position yourself for SEO. And that's it for this video. If you found value, go ahead and click this um, like button, give me a thumbs up, and again, click the subscribe button, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Take care. Talk with you soon.